up next, making the difference for small business. How one organization is helping business owners take their enterprises to the next level. Now our Making a Difference report, small businesses are the backbone of our community and our economy. And sometimes business owners need help, but they don't know where to turn. That's true. NBC 5's Leanne Trotter shows us how the Chamber of Commerce is filling in that gap. How's that? Good. After six years in business, it's very vintage inspired, as you can see. Panay Kofi Bruce is ready to take Mignonette Bridal to the next level. We are trying to revitalizing the art of couture for wedding gowns. So we actually make all the gowns that you see here in the shop. Her biggest challenge is finding new resources and financing. And that's why she ended up going to the Chicagoland Chamber of Commerce. So now we have all these human resources questions that I need to get answered and all sorts of staffing questions. Six months ago, she started working with Florence Hardy, a small business consultant at the Chicagoland Chamber of Commerce. What I provided is access to classes and ongoing training that she can now take at her pace um, that she didn't know existed, most of which are even free. These are old types of units, but we... For the owner of HVAC Technical Institute in Brighton Park, his hope is to eventually open schools in other states, and that's why he's working with the chamber. She gave me a great roadmap on how to do my research. She provided some key things. She even made me look at my school and basically do like a resource map, see what we have what we would need to do something like that. So she really opened my eyes. When we go out into the neighborhoods, we want to make sure that the businesses there have the same access to resources that the businesses downtown do, that the businesses in the suburbs do, so that everyone um, can reach their potential. Long range, the chamber is hoping to service small businesses in more neighborhoods. It's not about business owners coming downtown and getting access to the service. We really want to bring the service to them. Which will go a long way towards helping small businesses survive. Leanne Trotter, NBC5 News. Thanks to Leanne. And we have some congratulations for local leaders who are making a difference in our community. The Kind Foundation has announced the winners of more than a million dollars in grants. Among them, Chicago Chicagoans Dr. Sandy Goldberg and Lam Ho. Dr. Goldberg's A Silver Lining Foundation helps uninsured and underinsured women get access to breast cancer screening and care. She's worked here with us at NBC5 as well. And Lam Ho's Community Activism Law Alliance ensures people understand their rights and get the legal help that they need.